my video. I hate to break it to you guys, but back to school is starting and I'm actually kind of excited. So today I'm gonna be going back to school shopping. This is the first one of the back to school videos. I wanna go to Walmart and Target and kind of compare the things that they have there because I just wanna see like what different stores are doing for back to school. Comment down below if you guys are excited for back to school videos because I have a lot coming up. But now it's time to just go get in the car and head to Walmart. We are now at the Walmart. Let's check out their back to school section. I feel like everyone dreads back to school shopping until you actually get there and you're like. I feel like the first thing that you need in back to school shopping is a journal, like a really adorable journal. I probably will get two just because I love journals. This is the hardest part, picking the journal. Oh. Look at that one, it's like a marble. I kind of love this one, I really like it. And then the spiral. These ones I feel like are harder to use because there's no like spiral so it's harder to open and lay it flat. Whereas the spiral you can just like set it down. There's also like little ones, like I really like that. That is really pretty. And then they've got like tiny ones. Look at that little baby, that's so cute. This is something Hope would like. Look at that, it's a big journal. Oh, and then they have like a notepad design, that's cool. I say I give these planners and notebooks a five star. <laughs> I decided to get the small marble journal and then the medium sized spiral floral journal. The next most important thing for back to school is pens and pencils and you're using them pretty much all year round. And my personal favorite pens are the Sharpie ones but I've never actually tried the like paper or mate or whatever. I've never tried these before and I kind of want to try just a bunch of black ones because I don't use colored markers at all. But I feel like I want to try these. Can you believe that there's so many different packs of pencils and like they're just pencils? I always get the sharpened ones. Oh, and then they have colored ones. I love these erasers. They're so pretty. I'm gonna get them to go with my pencils. Look at these. They're so pretty. Wait, these aren't highlighters? Highlighters! I thought these were the highlighters and I was like, there's so many colors. Pens and pencils. Check. Now for pencil pouches. I kind of I haven't really found one that I really like here. So I think I'm gonna save that for Target because like they're nice. They're just like kind of like, I don't know. <laughs> That's cute though. That's funny. Next, I need scissors. Oh, okay. I think I'm gonna get the pink ones because pink, obviously. Look at all this locker stuff. Oh my gosh. I actually am ordering some lockers for like a school setup and I, I'm homeschooled so I don't actually have a locker but since I'm ordering one, I could totally do like a locker DIY, how to decorate your locker, super cute if you wanted me to. So comment down below because that would be like kind of cool. We gotta get stuff that's like the basics, you know. Sticky notes, index card box, index cards, finders, like not the super like exciting stuff because it's just kind of like the stuff you need and I feel like it's cheaper here at Walmart. I can't tell you how long I've been needing new push pins and I'm so glad I'm finally getting some. Boom. Oh my gosh, this is so cute. Ooh, and then extra staples. Boom. Look at these. I really like that one up there but it's kind of big. I think I'm gonna go with this one as my final Walmart backpack. Oh my gosh, look how cheap that is. It's got the little pom-pom, it's got the big pocket, and then the bigger pocket. Adorable! Look at all these binders. There's this one, and it's like, oh, oh look at that one, that's so cute too. That is so pretty, like look at that inside too. Comment down below what days you guys go back to school. I'm not exactly sure, cause like I said, I'm homeschooled so I don't have like an official, like this is the day we start. I just kinda start when my other siblings start, which I'm not really sure, wow, I'm really good at this. Also, make sure to stay to the end because I'm doing a haul of everything I got. <gasps> Rulers, shabam, always need one of these for projects and stuff. I almost forget to got, what, what? I almost forgot to get lined paper. <laughs> Got the paper, hole punch. These are the lunch boxes at Walmart. I'm excited to see how different they are to the ones at Target. I like that one. Look at, oh my gosh, Mom, Mark Adam would love that one. I'm gonna get this for like my papers and everything like that to store it. And you see that floral? It matches the notebook I got and the backpack. I didn't even plan that. These scissors are for the house because we're always running out of scissors. <gasps> oh my gosh, I'm so excited to wear this at school. Well, wait, I'm not going to school. Wait, but <laughs> oh, when you forget you're homeschooled. And our total at Walmart was $80. When my mom told me that, I was actually really surprised because we got like a whole supply of school stuff. We have a dilemma. 
This is, I feel like we're not even at Target right now. Their school stuff isn't set up. What? Like what? Well, we'll probably just go to a different one. It's like 30 minutes away, so I'm sure it'll be fine. You guys, 40 to 30 minutes later, we are at a different Target. Target now and we're gonna start by looking at the notebooks because that's what, what we did first at Walmart. They have a whole bunch of just like the plain colored ones. But look at these. Look how cute. Look at that one. It's like that's watercolor. You baked me crazy. That's so cute. Oh my gosh. Look and then these are their small journals. Uh, wait, are these planners or? Yeah, these are journals. Look how pretty that one is. All right, I'm getting, I'm getting this notebook and the plan is to get every single thing we got at Walmart but get the same amount in Target and see which one's more expensive and which, you know, set of stuff is nicer. At Walmart, I got a small journal and a medium-sized journal. I'm gonna get this journal. No books, yay! These were the pens I was talking about, the ones that are really good. Sharpie pens, these are my all-time favorite pens. They're so smooth. All right, the last thing we need for the pens and pencils are pencils. We'll get these then. At Walmart, I got paper, so I'm gonna get paper here. Ooh, I think this one has more. Look at these. I have a feeling that this like wouldn't fit any pencils, but it's cute. I need this. It's a pencil sharpener that's in the shape of a rainbow. What? Then we've got just some normal rulers. We got two rulers at Walmart and then a pair of scissors. These are all the other pencil pouches. They're like not that interesting, but neither were the ones at Walmart. The planners here are gorgeous. I love the like pastel. Time to get a binder. The only decorative ones, first of all, are these ombre ones. And then I think I kind of want, since at Walmart I got a big one, I think I'm just gonna get this plain yellow one. Yay, look at these little mini staplers. I always love these. Oh, look, look at that one. It's like minion colored. Here are the backpacks. I feel like they look just like the Walmart ones. They're really, really cute. All right, so we are at Target right now and I don't think we're gonna get a backpack because we didn't find one that was like, oh, those are so cute. Pew, we just got these pencils. Oh, they're so pretty. And for cute, we're gonna get these targets. Look how cute everything is. It all matches and like the yellow with the light pink. Oh. School essential. Mine. Okay, guys, I am back home, and the total for Target ended up being sixty-seven dollars. But we also got a lot less from Target, which I'm kind of surprised about because usually Target is like full jabam packed, but both of the targets we went to didn't have a whole lot of stuff, but they did have some very good gems. Walmart stuff I think was cheaper, like the basic pens and staplers and all that was a bit cheaper, like, you know, like a dollar and 50 cents cheaper. I'm gonna start by doing a haul of everything I got from Walmart because that was the first store we went to. I love the folder I got, oh my gosh. Walmart had this adorable folder. <gasps> Inside, it's like polka dot. This is so pretty. Then I got a bunch of already sharpened pencils because sharpening pencils is like the biggest struggle of the school year. Let's be real. But along with the pencils, I got a bunch of these cute little erasers. I love these and they're so bright and colorful and they're just really handy. Then I got this mini stapler and then I got some extra staples. Then I just got these index cards and I forgot I didn't get them with lines, which I totally should have. I forgot to get the ones with like lines on them. They didn't have lots of index card boxes, but like I didn't really mind. I think this one is perfectly fine. It's just a clear pink box with some polka dots and it's super cute. I also got a pack of highlighters. This has one, two, three, four, five. Five highlighters. Then I got some pink scissors. We also ended up getting two other pairs of scissors just for the house because we're always running out. Da -da -da -da! This beautiful floral pink folder. I was gonna say finder. I've been on my computer too much. It separates all of your papers. You could put like old homework in here. A long time ago, I used to think these were like purses and I was like, that's not cute. Then I got some push pins. These, I didn't get just get them for school. I like to hang up all my wall decor with push pins. I've already used them because they make smaller holes in the wall and they're so much easier to just like push them instead of getting a big old hammer and stuff. So it's super awesome. My notebook from Walmart. I actually love this so much. I'm so excited. So in this whole entire day, I got four notebooks. I'm gonna use two of them for school. I'm gonna use one of them for a secret project and then one of them for video ideas. I just got some extra paper that I can use for writing stuff. I got another little journal. This one is marble. It's kind of like greeny blue. I don't know, I think it's really cool. I'm probably gonna use this one least out of all of them I got because there isn't like a spiral. Then I got this three hole punch. This was mainly for my mom because she wanted it for to like organize my 
homework and stuff. Then I got the Papermate Ink Joy pens. I just got, let's see, one, two, three, four, five. These look really, really nice. I'm excited to try them. Then I got two rulers. My mom suggested to get one with a cork back and one that's kind of like a bendy. Lastly, from Walmart, do, 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 I got my bag. It came with this keychain. Let's see. $19. It's so cheap and it already has a pom pom. It doesn't have the most room, all of this right here. This is an actual spot, so the back, the real size of the backpack is really small. But since I'm homeschool, I'm not actually gonna be using this for books. So I wouldn't recommend this if you have lots of books, but if you're going to like a sleepover or you just want it for an accessory, this is a good backpack for you. But they did have lots of other sizes at Walmart. Moving on to Target. He managed to fit everything in one bag and I was like, for my binder, they didn't have like that many pretty binders, so I just got this yellow one. This, I'm not saying this isn't pretty, it's just like not decorated. For my journals from Target, I've got this one, and it's my total aesthetic. It's like pink, and then in the back, got other little emoji thing. Then I got this one. This one is also perfect for video ideas, and it's just a plain pink journal. Perfect to just sit on my desk and chillax, and this is wild ideas on it. Got more paper, you can never be too safe. I got some sharpened pencils from Target. Then Target had this one second that was like all pastel stuff. So to hold pencils and glue sticks and whatever, I'm gonna be using this this year. It's a little popsicle and it's like so adorable. I love the colors. These are little ice cream cone pens and they're just adorable, especially on my desk. They also have this pencil sharpener that's a rainbow and you guys saw, I was so happy when I, when I saw this, I was like, what? I need that. Then we picked up some glue sticks. These are just some pastel -y colored glue. I know glue doesn't need to be like all fancy, but I thought these were cute. I got some more pencils. These are really colorful ones. Highlighters. Bam! And for my pens, instead of getting the mate ones from Walmart, I got Sharpie pens. These are my favorite. I love Sharpie pens. Then I got this little stapler with a thousand staples included. It's like minion. And two rulers. This one is like a hard one, and then this one is a bendy one. And that is everything I got for school 2018. Rip summer 2018. I missed you a lot. Comment down below if you guys are excited for back to school videos to start. I'm getting a new setup. I've got some lockers coming in the mail in a few days, so that's exciting. Over Although I think Target and Walmart are both awesome stores to shop for back to school stuff and they're very cheap and they've got adorable stuff. I think I prefer Walmart today, just today, because they had more stuff and they had cute backpacks. Thank you guys so much for watching and I will see y'all in tomorrow's back to school video. Bye!